Welcome back to DNA Mobile Gaming. Today we're going to review an awesome mod that you can add to your Game Boy Advance. It is the battery charging mod from Retro 6. I ended up purchasing this from Handheld Legends. So let's go check it out and see how easy it is to install. All right, so a couple weeks ago, I ended up ordering some more parts for my already modded uh, Game Boy Advance. As you can see here, I've been playing some Pokemon Red for the last few weeks. And I'm going to share with you guys something that I ended up purchasing from Handheld Legends again. To finalize my mod, uh, right now my mod is just the backlit display and of course the game uh, shell or the cartridge bleh. the shell not the, the bleh the shell uh, I never did the bat or the the speaker mod because I didn't really think that it needed it I play on like a low volume anyways so if you guys want to watch my installation video for this actual shell and uh, display you can go to my other channel i'll put the link in the description for that but today i'm going to show you something really cool that i think is something you need for your game boy advance no matter if you have the the backlit display or not it's something that will save you a lot of money in the end which is inside this box right here so let's open her up. There's a list of stuff that I purchased. And you can see some capacitors here and resistors in that uh, bag. That's for something else. And there's some battery door compartments. It looks like my battery door compartment for the actual Game Boy is there. Uh, this is for my Sega Game Gear that I'm going to do another video segment on trying to repair it. And there's the battery for what we're going to be talking about, which is our rechargeable battery kit. And these are all uh, extra battery. Oh, it looks like my sticker's in here as well. I, want, I wanted to purchase another decal for the back. And there's Handheld Legends business card. I like their business cards. They're pretty cool. And there's another sticker that they give you. Another sticker. And these are my custom stickers that I got. So I want to put these on the back. Because right now I just have the Retro 6 generic sticker. And then here is the top sticker. And I thought these were pretty cool looking. So that will finalize my Pokemon modded Game Boy Advance. So what I'm going to be talking about is this battery chargeable USB-C mod that I think everybody that owns a Game Boy Advance should get. I have never purchased one of these yet and like I said there's some parts in here for my Sega Game Gear. Sorry if you can hear some background noise. It looks like there's a little bit of wear, maybe not no, they're good. They're just battery doors. They're not really anything too fancy. But I'll check those out later in another video. And get back to what we're talking about right now. Which is this awesome Clean Juice. Uh, Retro 6 is the company that manufactures these and sends them out. And it's literally just a board that is able to charge this battery while it's inside your Game Boy Advance. And this doesn't come with it. Uh, I think the reason why they don't offer this door is because your Game Boy Color or Game Boy Advance could be a different color. So I ordered one to match the yellow of my existing case or shell. So basically this has a charging port on the bottom, which is pretty sweet for the USB-C style charge, which is the modern USB cables that we use these days. So I'm going to pop this back off and we're going to check it out and see how easy and simple it is to install this. 
goodbye batteries, hopefully forever. So I'm going to assume that we don't need the battery terminals in here anymore. So we can take that out. And we're going to look to see how this actually sits in here. So I'm going to assume that that just kind of, yeah, that just slides right in and pushes down. So maybe attaching the battery might be a little bit helpful because it's a pretty flimsy board and you want it to, yeah, so basically we'll, we'll attach this battery and there's some 3M tape there. So we'll peel that off. And I don't think you have to do that, but if you don't want to stick it to the, the battery permanently, which it is able to be peeled off if you're really gentle with it, I'm pretty sure. And let's pop that in. And let's see if we can get that right into the I'm going to try to get this on camera. And there we go. That was actually pretty simple. And it seems like it fits in there. Now I have a modded shell as well. Uh, this shell was purchased solely just because I didn't want to uh, do any cutting of my shell. And if you line up the USB-C port. So yeah, if you line it up and then push down and click, that's pretty flush. That looks nice. Of course, if you don't want to order this piece and you have a Dremel kit and you want to try to line it up yourself, you can do so. But I think it was only a few bucks. Uh, let me look at the box. So I think the battery compartment, uh, Game Boy stickers... It was, it was under $4 US. I know that for sure, just for this little battery compartment. I'll put the link in the description for that. Uh, I do have an affiliate link that will direct you to all the parts for Handheld Legend. But let's see if it's fully charged from... Yeah, it's charged up. I don't know if it's... Is it green? Yeah, it's fully green right now, which is good. Everything works. So that was awesome. No more batteries. You don't need any more batteries. And again, you don't need batteries. <laughs> so back in the day when we were kids, you probably had batteries that you recharged or you had a handful of batteries in your pocket just in case, you know, you didn't want to lose your saved game file or, you know, miss out on any gameplay. So yeah, basically this is it. I'm going to test it out and give you guys a, a updated review, probably in a short, as to how awesome this, this uh, rechargeable battery kit is. It was pretty simple to install. I would give this a 10 out of 10 right now. And it's got a 1700 milliamp battery inside it, so I can imagine that lasting at least a good solid 8 hours uh, of solid gameplay uh, of course it depends if you have your volume all the way up and your brightness i'm going to turn my brightness down here so you guys can actually see the game but yeah that's uh that was awesome that's going to be a big help and the battery itself was under 50 dollars us as well so that's pretty sweet i'm in canada and it only took a couple weeks to arrive uh, the first time i ordered from these guys I ordered uh, via UPS because I wanted this before Christmas. I don't know why, I just really wanted it. And, well, I do know why this screen is amazing. And all I do is play this every night before bed now for about an hour or two, depending on how tired I am. So, yeah, check that out. The affiliate links will be in the description of the video for uh, this mod in particular. And you guys should go get a battery for your GBA. I'm going to stick these stickers on now quick. 
and you guys can watch this part or not this is just going to be the end of the video but let's stick these on here i'm going to get this up close so that i can stick them on nicely So thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you've never been to my new channel. I might have to use some heat to de- Ow, stick. I just used my nail and stabbed myself with that other sticker. So goodbye Retro 6. And so far we got the first sticker on there. Comment below if you guys have purchased one of these and enjoy it as much as I'm going to because now, like I said and emphasized quite a bit now, no more batteries needed. Batteries not included. Look at that Pokemon. Well, take care. Thanks once again. This is DNA Mobile Gaming. Next time, we will play this. Awesome. Pokemon Red.